Angie. I'm 37, and my hometown is St. Louis, Michigan. I was 22 when I found out. Um, my son was four, and my daughter was eight months old. I said, well, what do I do now? And I, when I was diagnosed, I didn't know anything about HIV. You know, back then it was a gay disease, a drug user disease, um, not a young, white, heterosexual female. And there I was, you know, 22 years old, white, single mother, getting ready to start college that fall. And what do I do? I just went and researched everything I could about it and educated myself about it. I told my family and they were mad, but they were just mad that I didn't tell them earlier. Susie, we could have been here for you this whole time. Like I said, it's went from white male to young women and, and teenagers, young teens, you know, they're the highest risk right now of getting it. Um, older women, you know, married women that wouldn't think, you know, oh yeah, it's really changed. You know, someone like me, you know, I had long hair, you know, I looked like typical average person that wouldn't have HIV. Understand that, you know, they're, you know, everyone's at risk. You know, they're not immune to it.